Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys a few different ways on how to add different numbers on your Excel program. So hopefully this should be a pretty straightforward tutorial and without further ado, let's jump right into it. So let's say we have a few numbers here. So let me just come up with a couple. So 34, 78, 56, 12, and 3. So there you go guys, I came up with a few random numbers here. So now if you want to sum any of them up, it's very easy to do. So we can actually just start by doing an either an equal sign or a plus sign on your keyboard. So if you're going to actually just be doing numbers individually, so if you only want to add up certain numbers in this series, you're welcome to. In order to do that, you just would left click on the plus sign on your keyboard or equals, and you just would go and select the individual cells you want to add. So let's say I want to add 34. And then I'm going to do another plus on my keyboard, 56, and I'm just left clicking on the cell here as I'm going. And then I'm going to do another plus, and I, let's say I want to add 3 as well. And once you hit enter, this should give you a sum. And you can tell up here this is the formula that's driving it. So when you actually left click inside this formula bar, it'll show you what cells are making up that sum. So pretty cool. So that's one thing you can try. Another thing, once you just delete out of it, if you want to go back and try different things, if you wanted to sum all of them up, you could do equals sum, so S-U-M, and then do a parenthesis. And now you can just go ahead and left click and drag over all the numbers in the row you want to add. So let's say it's all in one vertical column. So I'm just going to highlight over all of them, and I'm going to do an end parenthesis to close off this set of data. And there you go guys, it's just shows sum, so again if you click on it, it's just going to show all of these in this entire vertical column being added up. So that's another way you could do it. So I feel that's a pretty straightforward and introductory way of how to do it. If you had multiple columns here, so let's say we had another area, so we could do like 1,223, 670, so forth. Add up this row, just go over here, left click on equals, sum and then we could just drag over all these. So basically one sum can lead to more sums, if that makes sense. So if you want to add up this, you get a total down here, and then we're going to add up all these in order to get this number. So pretty straightforward. You can always follow the formulas just by left clicking on the numbers, and you can see where it's pulling them from. And it might be pulling them from different sheets as well. So I hope this is a pretty straightforward tutorial, basic introductory to the sum formula or sum function in Excel. And I look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.